Hey there guys, Skippy here from Skippy6 Gaming coming to you from Tutorial Land with Tutorial Love. Guys, we are going to be working on a super awesome cow farm today, guys. Pretty much the best there is. Give them some water, give them some love. If you really want to collect the XP, everything's good. It's pretty much automatic, you'll see. It's, it's as, auto, as automatic as it gets. Uh, you see the babies popping out. You probably could squeeze a few more lovins in there. Yeah, there's a couple more looking for the love. And yeah, so you see them all pop down. That's good. We want to stop them from breeding. Okay, cool. And then pretty much all you got to do is uh, turn this lava on and leave. Once you're done, once they grow up, they go ahead, they die, they give you some cooked meat, they give you some leather, everything that's good. Again, you can grab the XP right here, very simple. And uh, yeah, when you come back, they won't be there anymore. You'll have the stuff you need, and you will be a winner. And that's about it. Yeah, go ahead and turn this off if you want to, it's up to you, and pretty much keep your cycle going. Pretty much automatic, if you ask me, because uh, it is now, right? You do your stuff and you leave, so and then it automatically farms them, but... Yeah, I think what we'll do is maybe get a little bit away from it because we don't want to cause too much trouble. And for this one here, guys, let's go for 301 likes. 301 likes is the goal for today. If you are one of the first 301 people to like this video, let me know which one you are in the comments below and you could be down like Luke. Luke was 299th, would have come in for the win just under the cut today. If you don't got time to comment, I'm down with that. Just go ahead and subscribe and you can get a shout out like Tree Frog, Rebecca, clumsy and Haley. so uh, this thing has a super small imprint as you can see or footprint look it's literally right there you build it right into your wall easy peasy lemon squeezy uh, not much of a challenge so for this one guys here you're gonna need two iron bars two hoppers two chests two buttons just bring a half a stack of blocks something like that one bucket of water one bucket of lava uh, four ladders for the side and uh, you don't need to you can just build some stairs if you want eight glass one repeater one half slab two dust and two dispensers so yeah let's start it off guys we're just i'm literally going to just build it in the ground right here in front it's super easy so once these guys are done like this go ahead i'm going to try to make some room in my hot bar right here right here two chests go to the back side of those chests bing bang boom hopper into it hopper into it once we've done this we're going to want two bars going on top of this guy but first guys we're going to make a little bit of a ring around it because iron bars are weird now watch it's going to just put one. We don't want that just yet. Uh, in the olden days, it didn't do that. So let's go ahead and build up the sides. So basically, let's build this guy up. Let's build this guy up. We're going to build it up four blocks. Once we've done this, we're going to be feeling pretty good about ourselves. We could go ahead and actually... Let's just fill in the back. Before we do that, let's grab our dispensers. And dispensers are actually easy to place. We're going to put one here. And then we're going to put one on top of here. Once we've done this, go ahead and fill it in now. Uh, we're going to have to do a little crouch placing. Hop right there, right there, right there. Looking good. Grab your two bars. Bar here, bar here. Look, feeling good. I love it. And yeah, so once we've done this, also we're going to want to go ahead and put a sign right there. A sign right there. So as you can see, the shape that's taking here is pretty much like most cow farms in the history of the planet. But what we're going to do is go ahead and crouch down and... You can bust these guys out. That will make all of your access. Make sure you don't leave any openings. There's your eight glass right here. So what are we going to do? We're going to go right to the back side here. And we're just going to go ahead and drop a right there. Block right there with dust. So now let's grab our buttons. We're going to want to put some buttons in the wind. And this is going to be the button for the lava. And then what we want to do is bring up this guy, just like over here. It's actually very simple. We're just going to need one repeater, one half slab, and some dust. So let's go over here. Let's get rid of this guy right here. Throw a half slab right here. We need one redstone repeater. Take it right here, right there, with some dust. Now we're going to just go on the inside right here and fill that up. Done, done, and done. So pretty much it is all done. it actually is done there you go guys that's as easy as it is guys you can make this so simply let's go ahead and grab some buckets of water and lava so you're going to want to put lava in this guy water in this guy and we're feeling good so i usually use item frames whenever i'm using stone buttons on stone because i've always been doing my tutorials in stone and I think that you can't really see the buttons that much. Uh, let's grab a few ladders. Let's throw that on the side as well. 
But um, looking good. So let's, you know what? Let's make it work. Again, if you're doing this in survival, guys, this is how you do it. <laughs> Everybody, just go ahead and get your wheat out like this. Find yourself some sucker cows and say, "Hey, sucker cow, come with me." And then go up here, "Hey, sucker cow, come with me." And once you get them up here, you're good to go. Once they go down there, they're not going anywhere, and it's that easy. So let's throw some cows in just to make sure it works. Uh, I don't know if I've hit a max or something. I probably did soon. And let's get rid of these stairs because no one's going to keep them. You only have to get the cows in there one time, guys. Literally one time, and then they're good. You press this button right here. They float. We want baby Oh, don't worry. There's going to be a way that we can fix this right now. Let's go ahead and uh, fix it. I've been doing a lot of farms. There's actually, I just did a sheep farm. Uh, I don't think the tutorial's out yet. Or I might have put it out before this one, but I'm not sure. But hopefully we can enter love mode soon because we got to do that. Get rid of some of them. So hopefully these guys can breed now. There you go. They can breed good. Once these guys go down to the bottom... Uh, I think my thing's still still jacked up, but as you can see, we bred them. It works perfect. They're going to fall through. Yeah, they got it locked so that basically... I guess I could kill them all oh, massacre style. There we go. So we should be good. All the cows are dead there, so we should get baby cows over here now. Let's go ahead. There we go. Give me baby cows. Give me baby cows. I think... There you go. Pop, 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 pop. And yeah, go ahead and turn this water off when you don't, uh, or put a sword in the in the item frame. It's up to you. As you can see, hit this button before you go. When you come back, there'll be stuff in there. Get your XP if you so desire. And there you go, guys, for the win. Don't forget to smash that like as well before you go. Don't forget as well to subscribe to my channel. Look, man, a six-minute cow farm. Come on, I remember my first cow farm it was like a twenty-minute video. Um, yeah, smash the like if you want to uh, show some love for the channel. Don't forget to subscribe if you want some daily Minecraft uploads. And uh, yeah, check out my server on PC, play.buzzplex.net with the uh, survival creative factions and all that jazz. So yeah, catch you guys on the next one.